Join us from the sideline shortly. And we'll be kicking off under the lights thanks to Coke Zero, real Coke taste, and zero calories. Our matchup features the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets and the Hurricanes of Miami. Exciting football as the bowl and national championship pictures start to take shape. Miami Horn has the ball teed up, and we're just about ready to get this one started. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes in. They've got a classic option attack. Everything begins and ends with the quarterback. He's Who got to it? make the right decisions Who about whether to keep it or Who pitch it out. A lot Who of these guys are really skilled, Who so if they get it wrong... Tackled after a decent pickup. Option play. Oh, what a hit. The intensity of this place is increasing. down takes a handoff inside and stopped immediate Ratliff doesn't like what he sees caught and this is going to be a first job of stepping up from the secondary and made a good stop before he could get many yards A good react down. Ratliff running the option on the pitch, and the ball is on the ground. The defense third down. This place is getting loud. Passes left, gets it out to the halfback. Nothing doing for the offense. Ratliff set to go to the air, and he tackles him hard. At the Ratliff doesn't like what he sees. Throws, and that one. They'll run the option. It's recovered. The defense was that close to coming up with a big play. Yeah. He drops back. Gonna go across the middle. Caught. Up the middle for a nice game. And they... Another run. What a play to set him up with a first and goal. All the big boys are on the field now. Both teams have their big sets out there. Good throw. They go with the option. He is drilled at the 20. Got to the option before it got to them. And he can't get away from the pressure. He was a sitting duck on that. And he 
Rams tackle right away. And wasn't intercepted. Tackle made at the 31 yard. Complete over the middle. That was a great of beating the zone coverage and getting the first down. First and ten. Out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Ratliff drops back on first down. He was under some pressure there. Well, sometimes as a quarterback, you have so many things to worry about. What's the coverage? Where's the pressure coming from? And so on that you lose focus at times throwing a catchable ball. Here, he just missed the target. Second and ten. Ball on their own 39. Let's see if a quarterback heaves it up there and one of his guys can come down with it. He gets it out to about the 47-yard line. And that'll do it. We head to the break. Still plenty of time left in this one. The score here in Southern Florida is Miami 14, Georgia Tech nothing. Georgia Tech is lining up to get this second half started. Jackson fields at the goal line. Oh, man. He took him 10. First down. Look at the throw. Unfortunately, I'm 16 yard line. Third down. Ratliff back to throw. Way to look it in. So the defense does it. Reese with the option. Good outside run there. They get four yards. Reese options out to the left. He makes his way to about the... and he's brought down for a loss. Pulls it in and he's in the open field. And he's all the way in for the touchdown. The wide receiver diagnosis, which is exactly what he did on that play. Throws complete. He's got space to work. At the 40, at the 30. To the 20, to the 10. On the option. Nice run there as they work the. Touchdown saving tackle, but it. Ball carry to almost break it there. Here's the pitch, and now the ball is free. And they got it.
on the ground, up the middle. Boy, did he look determined running the football. Another yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. They can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. So our score, 21-14. Down the sideline. He finally goes down at the six-yard line. That was simply a sensational return right there. Offense that can put him up by two scores. It's third down from the four. Ratliff calls an audible. your running backs keep getting into loss of yardage situations. It'll wear down the best of them. From their own 24-yard line, it's third down. Quick toss. He's tackled at the 45. He liked the fit through the gap and made a great tackle. Reese drops back. Decides to slide. Hey, sometimes the defense... Ball on the 40. Option here. Hit hard. Stop. He drops back. And he's going to come up with a sack. It looks like the defensive... Reese back to throw. Can't find his man, and they'll turn. And they'll run him again. Nice run up the middle. Less than three minutes in the game. Got it, and brought down immediately. To go. They go with the run. They go to the left for just under two minutes in the game. They give it to the halfback, and he's tackled very quickly. The defense up the first down on the ground. I'm very surprised they didn't try to pass for it. And it sails through the uprights. That's a good feeling for the kicker and his teammates to know he's put this game out of reach. 23-yard line. It's third down. Taken down in the backfield. They put everyone up on the line. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. going to do it for this one. Our final score, Miami 31, Georgia Tech 14. So, Kirk, how would you sum up the action in this one? This is about what I expected to see in this game. Georgia Tech came in here hoping to win, but not expecting to win. They need to develop that winning attitude and mentality if they're going to win these type of games.